What up guys? Today I'm going to teach you about uh, what's it called? Natural harmonics, right? It will not have fret markers, but it'll be easy because you know how to count, I guess? Okay. What is a harmonic? A harmonic is basically just So, a harmonic is just basically a sound you can make on guitar. Pretty cool. Yeah, it's pretty cool. <laughs> now I'm going to teach you. So, if you see here, it's you know, wrong way, right? You see here, this is the 10th, this is the uh, 7th, and this is the 5th. These are all fret markers, as you guys already know, because I bet you guys at least play an instrument if you're watching this. <laughs> so, so let's just learn the easiest harmonic, the 12th uh, fret harmonic. It's kind of a hard placement, but uh, but if you learn this one first, you'll find the others pretty easily. So you put okay, you put your middle finger on here on the 12th fret. This will all happen if you do it wrong. You don't want to press down really hard. Do it like... If you like... So basically, let's just say, if you're trying to... You know, you know when you like have that feeling when you touch the water like that? Like the water like comes up naturally and when you push it down, it sinks. Just want to have it lightly touching the string it have that sound so one thing you might be doing is wrong you're putting one of your fingers obviously it's pretty dumb because you'll meet all the strings one thing you might be too far from it have it exactly on it's like can only have it one millimeter away if it is away from the fret. Right, so I think up to now you have learned the 12th fret harmonic. Time for you guys to learn the 7th fret harmonic. It's a tiny bit higher in pitch. I'll, I'll make another video explaining the science of harmonics. So. So again, you put it on the fifth fret, which I believe is here. No, seventh fret, sorry, I'm just dumb. Okay, all right, press it lightly. This one you want to have a bit more force in, because this one is just loud than this one. I'll explain the science of harmonics. Why is it loud? Why is it quieter? Blah 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 blah. blah. So, up okay, here, it'll create a ringing sound as well as the 12th fret. But you need a little bit more force. Right. Next lesson. No, ne next harmonic. Uh, fifth fret harmonic. This is pretty high, but pretty hard to get. So the higher, so the higher the one is, the higher the harmonic, the harder it is to get. So you get the fifth fret. Notice if you do this, like strum harder, it will work. strum with the flesh of your hands, not the nails. Guys, the fifth fret harmonic just won't work. Next harmonic. So technically, if you only if you have a cutaway, you can technically do this. But if you don't have a cutaway, I can show you a way you can do it with your strumming hand, which is kind of awkward. 
as you might think if you're a beginner trying to learn how to use harmonics. Right, it's pretty simple. What you see here. You know when you're putting your this hand really lightly here to make a harmonic. What you want to do here is to do the exact same. Let's say it's pretty easy on the index finger. So you put your index finger on the fret. So look, like that. What you want to do is you, okay. So imagine you're breaking the L shape to like, I don't know, tease tease your hater or something <laughs> just like do that and like, uh, pick the string behind it so if you see here this is what people do wrong they don't even touch it so if you touch it like this it makes a sound so basically it's kind of hard to explain just pick the string while your pointer finger or index finger is on the fret. And technically you can do this with the 12th fret as well. Right. There's also another harmonic that I'm not going to get into because they're pretty hard. Like 10th fret harmonic. Oh, I actually did it there. I mean, yeah, let's learn it then. <laughs> so... 10th fret harmonic, you just say, like, go on the 10th fret and repeat the same process. Just with the flesh of your finger, if you do it with the nails, it's gonna meet the strings. So, so that's a high harmonic, which means it's going to be harder, which is a harder way. There's also another one, which is, I'd say the hardest harmonic to do, it's the 3rd fret harmonic which I'm not going to go to detail with. You can only faintly hear it. Next video, I'm going to teach you about artificial harmonics. Bye!